Oh wait, I want to come to tea. Let's go tea. You have my thank. Iggy tea, yay! Professor, I'm. You I need to buy some thing. new tea. Would you like an egg McMuffin? Because I'm loving it. Close calls or past laughs? Let's talk about past laughs. They were it. drawn into the conversation. Hello, everyone. My name is Reginald. I'm your tea master of ceremonies. Today's food spread brought to you by McDonald's and Entenmann's. Uh, yes. Relaxing at the sauna, working hours, or a place you'd like to visit. Yes. Tell me about a place you'd like to paint, Iggy. <laughs> the conversation remained lively. Holy smokes. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Tea time is going smashing at the moment. All right. Evaluating allies, thanks, or dreamy nights. I'm gonna say thanks. I think somebody needs to thank Iggy for it. Right. They, oh my God! The crowd goes wild! No, don't laugh, it's not funny. I'm realizing that I can learn a lot from you. You can. How about, we'll sip tea. I always screw this one up because it doesn't make any sense. Yeah. Damn it! That's not what you wanted, however. That's the end of tea time. You missed it again, you stupid f Thank you for the delicious tea. I'd be happy to join you again whenever you like. Sorry I let you down, Iggy. Thanks for inviting me. You're welcome. Thanks. Would you like some tea? How about fashion? Are you good into fashion or gardening? Gardening? Oh! Piss! Uh, Gerald. I mean, come on. If this isn't right, I'm boycotting this game. Of course they were drawn of the conversation. It's the only f thing she talks about. That wasn't hard. My God. Strange fish. She did say she was a fisher person. Capable comrades are relaxing at the sauna. I don't know about comrades or fish in the pond. She does like to talk about the book. Oh, the middle one. The conversation got lively recovering. To possibly be a nice day time. Glad I didn't go with the fish. Invite me by again sometime. <laughs> hey, let's talk about my dead dad. You want to talk about my dead dad? Laying siege to a keep is like asking a girl out on a date. No! Past her defenses, no, it is not! Your move. This is the worst. At what point in the relationship do you employ trebuchets against the woman? Just let me know. What is What is that? Can you make an analog to trebuchets? Is that... Can you? Can you, Sylvain? Can you? Do you want to go to tea oh, and we'll talk so about much. this? How do I poison tea? I'm going to hey, poison hey. this. Sorry for the wait, Professor. Thank you so much. Ah, delicious. Yes. Now, you and I need to sit down and talk about this siege analogy and why I, I took you back to my room, not because I wanted to be put under siege by you, which again is not a good analogy for relationships. But yeah, hi. How's it going? Are you paying attention to me at all? Yeah. Yeah. The conversation got lively. Would you like a McMuffin? Wollen Sie eine McMuffin? Delicious. Dreamy nights, monastery mysteries, or mighty. Let's talk about dreamy people, I guess. No. Oh! They don't seem very interested in this topic. Sylvain may be straight as an arrow. Advice? Things that bother you? You seem well. Sure. Yeah, you know, talk to me about women. No. Oh, piss! This is not going well at all. Sylvain, you got, look, you, we don't have much to say to one another because you're going to start talking about how do you want to employ the battering ram, and I'm not okay with that. You need to know that that's not okay. You need to know Thank that that's not- Thank you for the treat, Professor. I'd like to do this again sometime. Listen, I think that- He'll never learn. Let's give Marianne a hug, okay? How about some fruit Thank you tea? For inviting me. You're welcome, okay? Just take a deep Thank breath. You Would you like much. some tea? Oh, hot. 
Now, let's talk yes. about you seeming well. You're doing really great. Ah! We're trying to tell you that you're doing quite fine. Huh? How about children? Conversation back arising again. We're fine. Yes. A strong battalion, reliable allies. I, can I rely on you, maybe? No, oh, piss! Everybody in the Golden Deer f hates me today! Not a good day for tea in the House of the Golden Deer. Sorry, Marianne, I really was trying to tell you that you were worth having tea with and ended up really. Thank you very you know. much for the tea. I look forward to doing this again. Sorry. Whose birthday is it on the 5th? It's Sylvain's birthday. I regret the last time we had some tea, but all right, we'll try it again. How about hey, four hey. spices? Sorry for the wait, Professor. Sorry for the wait, you just barged in. Thank you so much. Is it hard to drink tea in full plate armor? What a wonderful aroma. I'm glad you like it. Would you like an Egg McMuffin? Yeah. Monastery, courtyard couple. How about, we'll talk about romance. <laughs> they were drawn into the conversation because Sylvain is basically directed by his loins. Hello there, Sylvain. Thank you for waving at me. Let's move on to the next topic. Crests, fish, or children? Crests, fish, or children? Maybe kids? Does he like kids? Is he going to be a good dad? No. no, he's not going to be a dad because he's not interested in anything beyond what happens between the sheets. Fodlan's future? Plans for the future or heart racing memories? Let's talk about heart racing memories because maybe we're going to talk about girls in the future. <laughs> they were drawn back into the conversation once again, most likely thinking about sex, but we will never know. Sip that tea for a... Delicious. Nice tea time. Thank you for the treat, Professor. I'd like to do this again sometime. All right, let's have tea with Claude. How about some Almiran pine needles for Claude? I'm happy to have this time with you. I don't know why. Mmm, it's a nice smell. I think I love this one. I know you do. And I know why. It's so relaxing. I'm glad you like it, Claude. Would you like an Egg McMuffin or would you love an Egg McMuffin? There's only two choices. Let's have a chat. Gardening or heart racing memories or security or gardening. Let's talk about, let's talk about some memories. Oh no! Quite embarrassing for Claude's voice actor to not get questions correct. Although I don't think this is the first time. Strange fish, first meeting or fashion, first meeting. <laughs> the conversation got lively. Working hours, a place you'd like to visit. Do you want to go visit places around and tear down the walls? The conversation remained lively. I'll take you to my hometown one day. There are some truly tasty dishes you can't find in Fodlan. Are you one of them? Ding. Let's not. Claudia and Claude are having an engaging conversation for a perfect tea time with three impactful conversations narrowly dodging a nice tea time. Probably because they love each other. Let's have a look, shall we? Look you at the macaroni and cheese face, earring. I have no idea what you find so interesting. It's the macaroni and cheese earring. You're waving too. Hey, Claude. Wow. <laughs> Oh, he's really? blushing. Let's look at your pauldron. Look at that pauldron. Some banter? It's so relaxing. I'm glad. Great tea time, Claude. Oh. Would you like an armored bear stuffy? No, thanks. You're welcome. Okay, bye. Ah, I'm afraid I've stayed too long. Thanks for the tea. Let's plan to do this again sometime. All right. 